Hi, my little friends. Last week, I planted an elephant bean. Actually, I planted three elephant bean beans, and I also planted some seeds from a dry flower I had that my father had given me. So my seeds from my dry flowers have not grown yet, but my elephant beans have. I read you a book the last time when we were planting. I just want to read you some of the parts that I really enjoyed and some of the parts that I followed while I was waiting for my plant to grow. Are you ready? I watered it almost every day, which I did. Did you? And I got lots of light and I had it by the window. When nothing seemed to change, I asked, is everything all right? Well, that's what I would think. I would think, hmm, is it okay? Am I watering enough? Is it by the window? Is it getting enough sunlight? Hmm. Mom said my plant was changing even though it didn't show. She said that underground, some roots had just begun to grow. Do you see the roots that are in underground here? That's what happened here. The, the plant was growing underground. And I watered it, and I left it by the sun, and I watched it every day. And when I went to check again, I smiled at what I found. Did you smile? I did. A tiny shoot was growing. It was pushing through the ground. Do you see? My second bean started to grow and it's just a little tiny shoot with a bud on the top. This one has grown a long stem, but that's how it started. It happened really fast too. So it was pushing through the ground. My shoot got sun and water and it also got some air. And then one day I looked and saw that leaves were growing there. That's what happened to my plant. You see, my leaves are growing, and I see another sh I see another bud here. What do you think that's gonna be? That's gonna be more leaves. Isn't it so pretty? Now, if you haven't done this yet, you could do it now. It's never too late to start. Grab some elephant beans. Remember to soak them the night before. Make sure you have a pot, make sure you have soil, and water and make sure you put it by the by the sun that's right yay i'm so happy my plant grew i'm so so happy so as i promised we are going to write a small little story about our plant if you like i said if you haven't planted yet you can do that okay so i'm going to write a story but i have a friend that's going to help me do you remember albert Remember the puppet, Albert the puppet? He's coming to help me. Now let's see where he is. Albert! Oh, Albert! I wonder where Albert is. Albert, where are you, Albert? Can you come and help us write a story, Albert? some seeds and look what has grown. Oh, that's so good, Miss Vicky. Want to write a story? Yeah! I would love to write a story, Albert. Would you guys like to write a story together with Albert? Oh, that'd be fun, Miss Vicky. Hi, friends. We're going to write a story. Yay! Okay, okay. Okay, Albert. We're going to start. We're going to write a story. You can help us, Albert. Oh, yes, Miss Vicky. I'm going to help you. Ooh, that's so special. Are you ready, guys? Now, you don't need to write anything now. When we're done, you can write a story with your parents and they can help you. You don't need to know all the words. They can help you spell them. You have all the words that we wrote, all the plant words and all of the sight words and then all the words that we sounded out. You could use any of those or you could use more, okay? Okay, Miss Nikki, you're talking too much, Miss Nikki. Oh. Okay, we better start. Okay, let's start. One week ago, okay, Albert, uh, one week ago, one, okay, one week, week, remember your mom, your parents can help you, week ago, that's right, Miss Vicky. Good job! 
Vicky. That's right, Miss Vicky. Good job. Vicky. Put. Remember that word, guys? It's a sight word. Put. Ah. Seed. Oh, good job, Miss Vicky. Oh, that's pretty hard, Albert. Okay, one week ago, Miss Vicky put a seed in a pot. Dot. Oh, thank you, Mr. Albert. <laughs> the days of the week. Fry and then day. That's right, Miss Vicky. Friday. She, that's you, Miss Vicky. She is you. She saw, saw a shoot. You see the little shoot over there? Oh, that, that's what we saw on Friday. But now we see this one too. That's what the shoot looks like. That's right, Miss Vicky. That's what his shoot looks like. On Friday, she saw a shoot. Shoot. That's right, Miss Vicky. And you have to put a dot there. That's your end of your thought. Hmm. Okay, today, yeah, today, today, today we see, what do we see, Miss Vicky? We see, what do we see, Miss Vicky? Hmm. We see what? We see a plant. Yeah, that's right, Miss Vicky, we see a plant. Good job. We see a plant. Wow. I do. I see a plant. Today we see a plant. Put a dot, Miss Vicky. That's the end of your thought. Okay. Good job, Miss Vicky. I'm going to read it over already. One week ago, Vicky put a seed in a pot. Good job, Miss Vicky. On Friday, she saw a shoot. She sure did. Today, we see a plant. Did you see the plant? Yeah. Yes, Miss Vicky, the plant. The plant. Whoops, I'm running out of room. Oh, Miss Vicky, right a little smaller. You're running out of room. The plant. Yeah, Miss Vicky, the plant has a stem. Can't you see? Oh, yeah. The plant has, you remember that word, has, has a stem. We have stem in our plant words. Stem. You could just look at that or get your parents to help you. Yes, Miss Vicky, it doesn't only have a stem, it has a bud. Oh, that's right. A bud. Bud. That's an easy word. Yes, Miss Vicky. It has a stem, it has a bud, and two leaves. Oh, that's right. It has two leaves. A stem, a bud, and two leaves. And two. I'm just going to write the number down. Yes, Miss Vicky, you can just write the number down. You don't need to spell it out. Oh, that's easy. And two leaves. Oh, Miss Vicky, leaves is a hard word to spell. I'll spell it for you. Al. E. A. V. Right, Vicky. E. E. How to spell that? S. Oh, S is easy, guys. That's right, Miss Vicky. Two leaves. The plant has a stem. 
I think we have that in our sight words. R! I think we have R in our sight words too. So! So, if you don't have that in your sight words, just get your parents to help you. S O. Happy! Happy! Happy. Now that's a that's a cool word to write. H A P P Y. That's right, Miss Vicky. H A P P Y. That spells happy. Are you done? Did you put a dot at the end? I put my dot at the end. Did you guys put your dot, your period at the end? That's the end of the thought. And you know what? That's the end of our story. That's right, Miss Vicky. Good job. It's the end of our story. Let's read it out. I'm going to read it out. One week ago, Vicky put a C in a pot. <laughs> On Friday, she saw a shoot. That's right, Miss Vicky. You saw a shoot. Today, we see a plant. The plant has a stem, a bud, and two leaves. We are so happy! Well, I'm happy. Are you guys happy? Oh, I'm really happy, Miss Vicky, that we had the opportunity to write a story together. It's going to be hard, but you know what? Get your parents to help you. And it's going to be fun. And then you can draw a beautiful picture of your plant under your story. That's a great idea, guys. Draw a picture of your plant under your story, okay? Good job, Miss Vicky. We'll see you next time. Yay! Wow, guys. Wasn't that a nice visit for Mr. Albert? He helped us write this story. But you know what he forgot? He forgot something. What's that? Well, Mr. Albert, I think we forgot a title for the story. A title, that's right. What should we call our story? What should we call our story? I'm gonna call it My Plant. Wow, that's a good title, Miss Vicky. My Plant, do you know how to spell it? M. M. Y. Y. That spells my. Now plant. P L Are you doing it? A N T My plant! Great title, Miss Becky! I'll see you later! Love you! Bye guys! Yay! Oh. oh, that's great that he came back to help us write the title. <laughs> Silly. So guys, here's our story. Here's my story. And underneath my story later, I'm gonna make a beautiful picture. And you can do the same thing, okay guys? Wow, what a great job today, yay!